Hi everyone, welcome to the Healing Guide TV. I'm Carol Serby. Thank you so much for joining me here today. Today I would like to talk to you briefly about symbols. Now everybody has a basic understanding of uh, symbols that you might use. You might use the, the laughing Buddha to bring joy into your life or you might use um, a crystal to you know increase the vibrational energy in certain areas of your home. The symbols I want to talk about are symbols that you can use for personal self-care and even even a little bit na more narrowed down than that is symbols that you would use as reminders for personal self-care. A lot of people as they're just moving into the healing arts and I, and I had this trouble as well is what do you do to remind yourself on a daily basis what thoughts you should have what activities you should participate in in order to move your vibrational energy higher in order to do things that are for your highest good now, what I normally recommend, and this will vary a little bit depending on your situation. What I recommend is, for you ladies, this one's really simple. You go to the dollar store and you buy a wooden bead bracelet. Or maybe you have one. Or maybe you have your children make you one. But something like a wooden bead bracelet on an elastic um, wrist strap. Okay? Now, the idea behind this wooden bead bracelet, and you would set intentions into it, and I will do another, I have another video um, that will show you how to program things with intentions, okay, to activate them, um, to, to manifest certain qualities. Um, so what you do is you set the intent and, and intention into the bracelet, and then you put it on. Now, it doesn't have to match your outfit, okay? Or sometimes, depending on what your routine is, just leaving it on your dresser or leaving it in the bathroom or leaving it in a spot where you're going to see it early. I personally, I like to do all my, all my higher vibrational activities a little earlier in the morning. Um, so you might leave it beside your coffee pot and then it would remind you to go and do your vibrational activities while the coffee is perking, okay, if you're a coffee drinker, or while the water's boiling. If you're a tea drinker, or, you know, hot water, lemon, whatever, doesn't matter. But you get the idea, okay? So, the idea is to have something where its specific purpose is as a daily reminder to you on what you need to do, okay? Pretty easy, straightforward concept. I've even heard of people, um, you know, say they live their their bedroom is um, upstairs or downstairs from the main living. So what they'll do is they'll take a little statue that they already have. Again, getting back to Buddha or um, whatever doesn't matter. But again, you program it with the intention, and they'll set it on their stair. So when they walk down the stairs in the morning, they'll see it and it'll trigger a reminder. Okay? So just a really cool little tip and technique. And you don't need to use this for vibrational energy work at all. Um, you know, you can use it if you're taking a specific medication for a specific length of time and you need a reminder. Um, you can use it for that as well. Um, if you need a reminder to you know, make sure to drink your fiber in the morning. You can use it as a reminder of that. The key to it is it's something you need to do for a shorter period of time. So for me, I adjust my vibrational exercises. Um, there's some that I do before certain events, and then there's some that I do every single day. So if I'm lear if I'm learning to develop a new vibrational exercise, that's when I would use it. Um, or again, if you're learning to bring your vibrational exercises into your day, 
than you would use it for 10, 20, 30 day period. Okay, well, that's all I have for you right now. Thank you so much for joining me here today. If you have any questions or you have any comments, feel free to put your questions or comments in the little box below. I will get them and I will address them and I will answer them. Thank you very much for joining me here today on the Healing Guide TV. I'm Carol Serby. Goodbye.